Hello guys and welcome back to my little lay of touch shop. <coughs> now when we left off, <laughs> I kind of want to say that the first half of the video was was quite entertaining, and then after that it just it just kind of went sour. Uh. Oh, uh, it's my stuff. I would love to do this, but I don't think she would be right around here by the time, uh, by uh, the time she gets to the bank. So, uh, that's just another point. Oh yeah, and if you guys don't know, <laughs> uh, I'm still gonna kill Patty because if you guys uh, don't know what the hell happened, I refer you back to part one of this board, which is part 19. Just watch probably the first about 10 minutes, I think, and that will pretty much explain uh, everything on why I hate Patty. Slash, this is three somewhere right here. I don't love it. <coughs> but look at that. I, I'm getting him halfway. Good self, good self. <coughs> so, I, I just kind of want to, uh, whatchamacallit, talk, not talk, um, I can't even talk. But um, w I just kind of wanted to talk about something that I talked about in my last two recordings, even though that I never went through. And I just like to kind of say that sorry, just having like burps. No, um, I I just kind of like to say that uh. If you guys really like public, political talk, uh, you could just mute the sound or whatever. But I don't think it's really that heavy of political talk. Just kind of more history and like maybe a low level political talk. But um, yeah. Um. So in the first two recordings, I talked about uh, the whole little quote history repeats itself uh, saying quote whatever like I I mentioned it in uh, all to my recordings and uh, this is my third time mentioning it but I, I just kind of and this, I have literally um Really, when it comes to mine, I don't believe I've ever really heard anything about uh, history actually repeating itself within the last uh, couple years, last decade, or whatever. Or nothing has really repeated itself yet. And, like, kind of let alone, I don't really think that history's going to repeat itself any time soon. Kind of within this decade. But I, I do kind of admit um, the only thing I can really see potentially uh, repeating itself right now is kind of quite possibly the Great Britain type thing. And that's only um I kind of want to say possibly like happen a hundred years after the original one, but yeah, um, I kind of believe that if anything, that's probably about the only thing that will actually heat itself uh, after the years. Not after the years, yeah. That's kind of like the only thing I can really see actually happening. Uh, anytime soon, and quite frankly, I do gotta say, 
it I could potentially say it. I mean, a hundred years after the first one, because just kind of uh, our fight, our uh, government slash national uh, ec- economy dead. But um, yeah. Like I said, I I could kind of see it because uh, one of my friends and I were talking about like how the government <laughs> don't ask because don't ask me why, but um, we we're just saying they're talking about uh, pretty much the collapse of the government or what would happen if the government collapsed. Not again. <laughs> Uh, don't do this. Come on, really? Uh, at least give me back the money I just wasted a turn ago. Oh, see this now. I'm just having bar again. Oh my god! I literally just spent uh, freaking nothing more. Eight, not eight hundred, like literally a thousand dollars just now, and uh, restocking my effing inventory for it just to go away. That is ah uh, irritating. Oh yeah, but like I was saying, uh, me and my friend were talking about pretty much the uh, clutch the government. I really don't remember why now. But um, uh, one of the things I was saying there, t- uh, talking slash saying, was pretty much uh. Actually, I don't even know what the hell I was gonna go with that, but um, like, just like uh, at one point, uh, he mentioned about the uh government county debt now, and it's like in the past year since I graduated. A year before him, and just like to see how well the economy dead went up. Uh, I I just kind of say that's like impre- I I can't say it's impressive because I mean, <laughs> it it's kind of sad to see how much it went up. But um, yeah, like. When I was a senior in high school and we took civics, uh, the eco- economic debt was, um, uh, what was it, thirteen trillion dollars. And uh, when my friend graduated just this past year, uh, the debt was was um, what was it, seventeen mil. Not a million, trillion. Yeah, if it was 17 million, I mean, I'm pretty sure most people will be happy. But yeah, it it was like at 17 trillion. And that's just like over one year, which is like three slash four trillion dollars. That That's kind of sad. Even though that I can't really speak, but considering considering it went up that much, that that's really kind of sad. I mean, like honestly, it is. And really, I don't really keep track of all government stuff. I mean, I do keep track of uh, some stuff, but not all stuff. And pretty much like I was saying on top of the first video, I mean, it does prove that I do um, read slash hear about some. But, um, yeah, like, uh, for it to just go up at uh, $4 trillion, that is just, like, I, like I've been saying, that's really something else. And then, uh, like I was saying, they're saying uh, if it happens in uh, years, that's a its own great suppression. Uh, I'd pretty much say that 
Uh, if it does, it would happen in what, 19 years? And um, if it happens in 19 years, it I think that it would pretty much be the cause of, uh, what's what call it, uh, pretty much the financial debt that the go- uh, economy is in. I mean, right now, we're probably actually in by, I want to say, maybe 18 trillion. I, I could just be off. But um, considering that if it happens, it's in about 20 years. And if it does go up at least by $3 trillion a year, that means that it's going to go up about $60 trillion dollars. And pretty much, actually, actually, I would have to say it'd probably go up between sixty trillion and eighty trillion dollars, and those about twenty years. And it's like, it, if it does, I mean that that's pretty much uh, how much uh, crap about seventy-seven trillion dollars. And that's pretty much only like saying they're saying the minimum. And I mean, that's not really even considering if we actually get a president that will actually reduce the economy's debt even more. I mean, if if we do get a president that uh, yeah, president that would actually decrease our economic debt, uh, I'm pretty sure a lot of people would probably be happy and everything. And yeah, I do realize that some, some um, the government is trying to actually get us out of debt by pretty much spending a whole lot of money in a banking account and just like saying they're trying to have it raise over the years. But uh, I believe my civics teacher was sitting there talking about how it really wouldn't actually help us. It would just more along the lines hurt us in the long term because, uh, quite frankly, uh, what was it? We would pretty much be spending more money than we are actually. Uh, yeah, we're spending more money than we're actually making. So then it's just dig deeper and deeper into our economy is dead and like I do realize that you can't just sit there and like stop making purchases and everything you like I do realize that you had to sit there and make uh, you had to like buy stuff I, I can't really say buy so but like spend money on important things when you're the president like it, it's really like inevitable to sit there and be like, no, I'm not gonna sit there and spend money or anything because people are probably gonna be pissed that you're that you're not like spending money to help better something or anything like that. But yeah, but like I was saying, um, that's one of the only things I can really see happening. Uh again, quote-unquote, history European self. That's literally about the only thing that I can... <sighs> oh my god, stop with these twos. Just stop. This is what kill me in this board now. I literally think it, this is what's going to kill me is all these twos slash below like four or five rolls. Oh my gosh. Alright, like I was saying, yeah, that... Pretty much, uh, that's what I was saying there thinking is that's pretty much what I think will probably cause, uh, kind of the, not the downfall, um, pretty much, uh, literally I, I'm just seeing her like blanking and everything, but yeah, that's... Uh, blah, 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 uh, yeah, my, my brain is just, like, shutting off right now, it's just like, no, no, we just need to go to bed, <laughs> it is 
twenty in the morning and you need to go to sleep. Yes, the stoner day. Ha uh, ha April twenty eighth day. JK. But um yeah. Um, like I was saying, uh, that's the only thing I can really see happening over again. And, uh, what's my call it? Uh, that's pretty much gonna cause a panic, uproar, and blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna quit this game. I really do feel like it. Just because of how horrible this game is going right now. Like, literally. I'm seeing Hurricane Deuce. I am pretty much like getting jits out of all my money again. Even though that the fucking bitch in the red dress isn't even getting it. But, like, she's still getting lucky. And so are everyone else. But, like, oh my god. It's really interesting to sit here and pretty much like start losing again because of the same effing BS. Yeah, like, oh my gosh. I I'm way behind the first person, and that's like even with double the money. I, I am so behind. It's getting close to the point of triple. And then just like what Miko's like two thousand, I think uh Cindy, I don't even know how much she's over. <laughs> yeah, right, I totally don't believe that. Even though that this is probably gonna help me because I think she has about what three thousand, maybe two thousand or something like that. We're about to find out on my next turn. Uh Saying they're like sick, not sick, just sniffing like no other. <sighs> Alright, so how much money do I have? Oh, a thousand. Not that bad. But yeah, seriously, ten bucks, this thousand dollars is gonna last. I quit. I literally quit. I am getting sick and tired of all these two rolls. Oh my god. It is literally getting sick and tired. I mean, I've rolled one, two, three, four. I've rolled like four or more twos straight in a row. This is getting ridiculous. Come on, can I, can I at least get, like, bonus money for staying here and getting, like, freaking, like, streaks of fucking rolls or something? Oh, yeah, that's effing awesome. The freaking sores open up for one, and I fucking mean one turn, or spin, or whatever, and I am the one that ends up getting paid. I mean, sitting there having to fucking... Nah, uh, paid in order to fucking ah. Uh, that's irritating. I'm. It's always something now. Like ever since I beat board first time, now it just has to be something that just like screwing me over. Like very literally, it it really just does have to be something that screwing me over. <sighs> Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, first it was Cindy on the very first recording that made me lose. Then it was a bitch in the red dress and it's not even uh, my karma slash luck, whatever. And I'm probably gonna sit here and start ranting about the effing freaking first recording, I mean, second recording all over again. But seriously, though, like, oh, I'm getting screwed over again. Yeah, well, I've lost about, uh, actually I lost a thousand dollars on the last freaking, uh, expensive item upgrade. 
freaking lost a thousand, and then I, I probably lost a thousand or lost one, maybe a thousand. No, I lost attention, but like seriously though, oh my gosh. <sighs> I am uh, just really getting frustrated with this right now. <laughs> oh, sorry. But yeah, like, there's only like so very little skill involved with this game, I believe. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Uh, I am just like gonna start having blonde blah commentary right now. Just mostly because I'm effing tired. I'm getting tired with this effing bullshit right now. Cause I mean, I, I'm literally I'm just like getting fucked right now. I am getting fucked by this game. So tough. It is unreal. And to just like stay here and talk even more. Just like have my first two videos I've been able to be compressed. And then to sit there and take me in the motherfucker balls over and over again to just have terrible luck and two straight boards all over again. That that's just something else. Uh. Oh yeah, I can totally choose what way I'm going. Bull fucking shit. I have to go. Right. Or maybe not. I swear it says you have to change direction. I you can. Yeah, I, I yeah, I'm just totally gonna go back the other way. And there's really no point in me restocking because I bet 10 bucks. That if I restock, I'm probably going to sit there and get a the card. Have, um, what's my call it? Get that expensive item again and pretty much waste another $1,000 on all the other bull crap. And, like, what? Like, honestly, probably er all the other players have that to me. Like, double right now, I swear. I mean, I've only been to a bank twice throughout this whole game. And in about, what, three years so far? That is... Oh my gosh. That is really kicking the motherfucker balls. Hi. Sorry, I'm so tired. But literally, I, I am just pretty much like getting kicked in the motherfucker balls so much on this freaking bore now. Like literally, ever since I just beat the board, I, I swear there must be something hidden about it. Like if you beat a board once and you go back for whatever reason, that um, you just like, Thump and uh, computer will just, just gets cranked up to insane difficulty or something. I don't know. Because I, I, I seriously don't think that, uh, even on the hardest difficult, not the hardest difficulty, but like on the hardest. <sighs> Sorry. Uh. But like on the very last board, I, I really don't think the computers played this tough either. Oh my gosh, so. Alright, oh, there. Uh, it's just like pissing me off on how bad this is getting again. I, I am like literally just getting kicked in the motherfucker balls. And yes, I will probably be saying a lot for I don't know what reason. Uh, let's see what we get. Oh, look at that. We got a 5 VB freaking A. 
Hey, look at that. I bought another store that only has fucking expensive items, people. Ah, uh, fucking A. Seriously, I'm just like getting screwed over so much right now. <laughs> well, wasn't it during the Merlin board too that I was like getting screwed over? Like whenever I had like get an extraordinary amount of money, I just get sent back like no older. Or or is it just me? Or maybe it wasn't the Merlin board. Maybe it was the beginner board. Or maybe it was one of the recordings that never actually made it. I never, whenever I got like money, it just disappeared. Because the F and E cards, event cards, whatever. But like, oh, I see that. What the F? <sighs> oh, yeah, yeah, you guys can really tell I'm tired. But hey, oh my gosh, this board is like no even close. I'm honestly surprised on how long this game is going on. Because on my other two boards that, well, of course, never made it. On the other two, by this time, on those recordings, I was literally about, on average, I'd probably say, what, um, average probably about eight, nine thousand by now. I mean, yeah, just ex including in my set last recording that I never made it. I was literally at like 12,000 right now. If not 12,000, I was in between 12,000 and 10,000. And just like right now, I I just have horrible luck. Because I am, I'm even still now, like getting edged out by number one, by double. And I just like even barely put still. Just the fact that I'm getting edged out by double is is really kind of sad. Considering the first two recordings, I mean, I was literally just dominating them. Yeah, and I barely even get anything. Don't even get caught up. 23 points. I, I really don't even think... That much is really gonna help me. Yeah, money, money doubles not gonna help. Woo. But then I still think I, um, what's my call it? Yeah, I deliver expensive item. <laughs> That's a joke. Yeah, like what? Well, yeah, here we go. Reduce from like 16 points. Yeah, then CB. No, I actually. I actually think that if I did that, it would only be her money right now, not the total. Hmm. Nah. Yeah, that'd be great. We've. Uh, cause I was I've been pretty much in the lead. So, I mean, I only have like a one in three chance to actually get something good. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure that would just be like the same thing as an event card. So, I'm not even going to bother with that. And I think that would help right there, but even then. I'm not gonna bother, and those, why not? But I don't think. Oh wow! It actually held quite a bit. Eighteen hundred six stores. Damn. So, 
yeah, I'm actually like right back at 13 points. And so all I would really need is to go back and pow another 1800. But then again, I would only be putting it in like 7600. Actually, no, about 8700 maybe. Oh, but that's not gonna help me much. Oh yeah, but then again, now I'm kind of thinking that the money doubled is actually just probably um, doubling the money that you get from the bank the next time you actually go to the bank. Oh, well, look at you. I'm probably wrong about that. <sighs> Yawn. I just popped something. Oh my god. For some reason, I think I probably could have closed that store and made a, a level 3 store. Okay, but it's just me, or am I the only one noticing that? Like, apparently, every time the stores are closed, is like the time that one starts on my store. Like I said, it might just be me. I don't know, but it definitely seems like whenever, whenever the stores are closed, people tend to stop at my store. And whenever, and whenever um, uh, they're all open, they never stop at my store. Oh my! I really think I am just like getting screwed with computers. I'd really all say computer conspiracy one. Just saying. I, I really do think it is. Computer conspir conspiracy whatever. Blah. Screw you, Cindy. Uh, and funny thing is, I was sitting there and saying I will remember her name throughout the whole board or the remainder of the game. End of the board. I literally straight up forgot her name. I was like, no, no, this is not happening. I I remember her name. I, I will remember her name. Can't do it. And the funny thing is, I was sitting there and I was thinking, I will remember her name because I'm going to remember Scary Movie. And Scary Movie Scary Movie has a girl named Cindy in it. Even though I'm pretty sure a majority of people have seen Scary Movie. But yeah. Um, yeah, that's what I was pretty much going to remember uh, her name by was Cindy. But yeah, apparently that didn't work out. I mean, like, literally, I was sitting there thinking, like... What is her name? What is her name? I can sit there and remember freaking Shorty and the guy in the hand, in the hands catcher, uh, the other girl, the other girl that's in there and uh, getting effed by the poultry guys. Oh my god, that was a great scene. <laughs> uh, Sam Perverter or whatever the hell you want, I don't care. That, that was just a funny scene. Just in there and just like getting effed. Just like on the bed and then just like going straight up on the ceiling. Oh my god, that was great. And actually, fun thing is, I'm, I don't know why I'm so cautious about like no kids watching this, considering that like most of my subscribers had. I can actually tell from what it seems like they're all like at least 16 plus so like I don't even know why I'm sitting here like not trying to have like make sexual con and I, I can't even say jokes but like say sexual self or anything like that I don't know why 
I guess it, that would be another good reason why you don't record in the morning. I really can't even say in the morning, but when you're when you've been awake, as I have. And actually, what the hell am I talking about? No, fourteen hours, almost fifteen. Yeah. Yeah, and ironically speaking, this is the same exact place, year five, that I would be getting ready for the pretty much finale of this board. But, like, as you can see, that's not the case. Because no one is close. No one's even halfway right now to even being close to... <laughs> the target score. I mean, like, Miko and me are about the closest ones. Miko over me, but, like, we're, we're the only ones that are really even close enough to actually uh, be halfway. And even then, I mean, we're still f a distance away. Huh, actually... I might be getting like what nine thousand. I think I'd get about nine around nine thousand by the time, uh, by the time I go to a bank next time. So I'm guessing I'll probably get like maybe eleven hundred again, and then another eighteen hundred unless someone buys a shop. So I'm gonna have one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I saw a six, so still should get eighteen hundred. So uh, yeah, it's gonna be quite an interesting uh, results. Yeah, yeah. See, I can actually play with skill. I guess it might be considered skill. But I can play with effing skill, and you have to rely on my effing paybacks, you son of a fucking bitch in a red dress. Just saying. But literally, though, she she really did just, like straight up rely on me just to win. Like literally, her six thousand came from me at least. And then she literally got about another 3,000 Vanguard. So it's like 9,000 total. So, like, really, if it weren't for the combinations, she would have only had about, like, 5,000, which is, like, way under everyone else. And just, like, in my opinion, I mean, that, I would have to really, like, take some... I really can't say the skill, because, like I said, I don't think this game really takes that much skill. I mean, yeah, it might take a little skill, but not that much. But, like, honestly, I, I had to say, it, it must take skill to sit there. And pretty much in your, like, two, to just sit there and have about the breaking point for the total. And then just, like... Being able to maintain about a 10,000 plus for a few years while just being screwed over and over and over and over again with all those events. Like, really, it, it must take some, not even some, it take like a decent amount of skill in order to actually do that. But like I said, again, that's just my opinion, but it really must. <sighs> oh, yeah, yeah. Everyone is getting a level 2 shop. And pretty much my level 2 shop is probably going to be shot, shut down again. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Nah. Screw you. Oh, man. I want my money back. 
because that was a horrible belt. I have never enjoyed this belt whatsoever. <laughs> no, not really though. I want my money. So I don't even wear belts, or even let alone I don't even wear pants in real life. Gosh, <laughs> pants are for losers, people. Pants are for losers. Remember that. Oh yeah, she so got eighteen thousand for just going around at once and what why the hell is my paintball case up there? Yeah, I'm not I ten bucks I'm not even gonna get freaking eighteen thousand for going there. Ten bucks about twenty one one yeah. Too bad. <sighs> freaking I hate I am really starting to hate this game so much. Just because of uh, like I said, just because of how bad I'm being screwed over. And like I said, in like the second video, are are you kidding me? What? She got seven hundred dollars cat. Oh, I I'm. I might just rage. I, I literally might just rage. But are you kidding me? She just got seven whole cash back. Come on, where the hell is my cash back? That is what I want to know. I am getting... Uh, <sighs> I hate this game, 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 I hate this game. I hate this game. Just saying, I, I hate this game. Uh, if you think uh, I didn't get my point, no, I mean, if you think I got my point through, I don't know. I hate this game, I hate this game, I hate this game, I hate this mother for game. I fucking hate this game so much now. <sighs> Can't see it, but I'm flipping you off, game. I am flipping you off. I'm just going to call it an episode. See you guys on the next part. One thing's hopefully we'll start turning around. No yeah, fat chance. But see you guys in Hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, that's why it's in the episode burping. Thanks, I'm having a good day, everyone.